students, welcome to my lesson. Welcome to my lesson. Page 73. Yes, team to team book. Let's start. Let's start. The past continuous and the simple past tense. Maybe you will remember. Maybe or maybe you don't remember. Sometimes an action is in progress and then another action interrupts it. To describe the action in progress, use the past continuous. Past continuous, teacher. What is, what is past continuous? For example, she was, she was watching television all last night. She was watching television or they were watching television or you were you were watching television we were watching television we're watching yes we're watching and i was watching i was watching okay second to describe the interrupting action use the simple past tense to describe the interrupting action use the simple past tense Hmm. Simple past tense, remember, students, she, she went outside, she went outside yesterday, for example, she went outside yesterday, go, went, go, went, this is irregular verb, or you, you went outside yesterday, or I went outside yesterday or we went outside and they went outside like this. Yes. Use while with the past continuous. Use when with the simple past tense. Don't forget. We use while with the past continuous and we use when with the simple past tense. Let's look at an example. While they were watching TV, their friends arrived. Yes, while they were watching TV, their friends arrived. Arrived. Happened at specific point. Okay? Happened at specific point arrived occurred once and stopped another one while they were watching happens happens over a period of time happens over a period of time this was continuing okay this was continuing second she was driving too fast when she had the accident she was driving too fast when she had the accident when she had the accident when she had the accident yes have had have had we can we can we can also we can also use it to talk about in action in action that was continuing, that was continuing uh, when it was interrupted, when it was interrupted by another action, another action, when, when it was interrupted by another action, action and progress. Don't forget, if the clause, if the clause, if the clause with when or while comes first, comes first, we use, we use a comma, we use a comma, yes, comma, this, we use comma, okay? Read the sentences, underline the action that began first. We will find 
we will find the first action. Okay, maybe it was raining when Jack went outside. Yes. Which one? First action. We will find first action. It was raining or when Jack went outside. Of course, it was raining. It was raining. Third, while she was taking a shower, her mom called her. While she was taking a shower, her mom called her. Of course, she was taking a shower. First action. Fourth, fourth, my dad phoned my mom while she was driving home. She was driving. First action. Circle. She was driving. Fourth part. Look at the pictures. First, look at the pictures. And choose the past continuous or the simple past tense. Circle. The correct verb. Yes. Circle. The correct verb. Second. He told was talking to his friend when he had or was having an accident. Yes, when. When he had, yes, when he had an accident. Yes, we use when, we use when with the simple past tense. Okay, with the simple past tense. He had another one. He was Talking. He was talking. Circle. He was talking and when he had. Third. Martha and Nina went or were going mountain biking when the storm began was beginning. When the storm began. Yes. Another one. Martha and Nina were Going. This was continuing event. Fourth, a dog crossed was crossing the street and the bus stop was stopping. Occurs once and stops. Occurs once and stop. Stops. So, a dog crossed the street and the bus stopped. Stopped. Luckily, the children wore or wear, were wearing their seatbelt at the time. At the time. This was continuing. Were wearing. Circle were wearing. Adult crossed, stopped, and were wearing. Next page. There is an essay. There is an essay. Can you see? Yes. Whose fault was the accident? First, I will read. Whose fault was the accident? Whenever we hear or read about a traffic or bike accident, we want to know what caused it. Was the operator of the vehicle, the driver or the bike rider at fault? Or was the accident someone else's fault? Did a person, a dog, or another animal unexpectedly cross the road? Was it the weather or the condition of the road? Or was something else responsible? Often there is more than one factor that causes an accident. In some accidents, the operator of the vehicle wasn't paying attention what was texting or talking on the phone? Maybe he or she was driving too fast or not following safety rules, suggest stopping at stop signs and traffic lights. In other cases, maybe there was a mechanical reason for the accident, or perhaps the driver or bike rider suddenly became sick. What we know, however, is that as long as people operate cars, boats, bikes, or any other machine or vehicle, there will be accidents. 
So what can we do to prove prevent injuries to ourselves or to others? First, we should pay attention when we operate a vehicle or ride a bike. Second, we should be sure to use safety equipment such as seat belt, helmet, life vest, and child safety seat. In the event of an accident, safety equipment can save lives and prevent serious injuries. Finally, we should take good care of our vehicles to prevent dangerous mechanical problems. We can prevent all accidents or control all factors. But paying attention, following rules, and using safety equipment are things that can help. I will I want to ask I want to ask a question. I want to ask a question. What can we do to reduce injuries in accidents? Okay. I will answer. First, we should we should follow rules. We should follow the rules and we should follow rules and it's important to it's important to check all vehicles regularly for mechanical problems okay yes that's enough that's enough second part circle a and b circle a and b according to this essay according to this essay circle a or b second cars bicycles trucks buses planes and boats are kinds of vehicles kinds of accidents which one of course a kinds of vehicles third texting talking and listening to music can be factors that cause accidents factors that prevent accidents which one texting talking on the phone talking on the phone and listening to music circle a factors that cause accidents four another way to say drive a car is Ride in a car? No. Operate a car? Yes. Circle B. Fifth, when something is not our fault, it is not in our control. Be our responsibility. When something is not our fault or your fault, it is not in our control. Circle A. Sixth, seat belts, helmets, life vests, and child safety seats are kinds of A and B safety problems, safety equipment. Of course, safety equipment shouldn't circle B. Seventh, last one. Another way to say if an accident happens is in the event of an accident, B to prevent. An accident. Accident happens. Yes. A. In the event of an accident. Next page. Which of the following statements express the according to this essay? Put ethic. Okay? Express the point of view of the writer of the essay. There can be more than one cause of an accident. There can be more than one cause of an accident. Yes, teacher. Put a teach. Put a teach. It is possible to pre prevent all injuries in accidents. It is possible to mm, all injuries in accidents. 
need. It is not, it isn't possible. Don't put it in. Don't put it in. Fourth, seat belts and child safety seats can help prevent injuries. Yes, yeah, of course, put a teach. There are actions people can take to prevent some accidents. Yes. Yes. Put a teach. Okay. What about you? Or what's your opinion? Complete the statement. The most important idea in the essay is for example, safety rules or safety equipment. Yes, you can try. It. Last part. Last part. Introduce a, a new topic. Express concern. First. We will listen and you will listen carefully, okay? Let's listen. Unit 10, page 75, teen to teen. Exercise 1, read and listen to the conversation. You're not going to believe this. Larry was in a car accident. Oh no, what happened? Well, his dad was driving him to school when another car hit them. The other driver was talking on his phone. Are they okay? Yes, they are. Luckily, they were wearing their seat belts. Listen again. Unit 10, page 75, teen to teen. Exercise 1. Read and listen to the conversation. You're not going to believe this. Larry was in a car accident. Oh no, what happened? Well, his dad was driving him to school when another car hit them. The other driver was talking on his phone. Are they okay? Yes, they are. Luckily, they were wearing their seat belts. Yes, we will create a new conversation, change the name of the person in, a, in the accident, and reasons for accident, change the reasons for the accident. Yes, you are not going to believe this. Sena was in a car accident. Sena was in a car accident. Oh, no. What happened? Well, her sister was driving her to school when another car hit them. The other driver, the other driver, the other driver wasn't looking. The other driver wasn't looking. Are they okay? Yes, they are. Luckily, they were wearing their seat belts. Yes. You will create a new conversation. Okay. Change the name of the person in the accident and change reasons for accident. That's all. That's all for now. Thank you for listening. See you later, students.